this wall is supposed to keep the water out. The sinking city of Jakarta. <laughs> This is our boat that we're going to take. Um, I think there's about 15 of us that's going to get on. So yay! <laughs> um, like I said earlier, we're going to do some snorkeling, going to some beaches. Um, unfortunately here you can't do anything by yourself because it's a conservation area. So um, you have to take this or you have to pay around 2 million for your own private tour. Can't find damn beer anywhere in this damn place. So if you want to get a beer, just bring them along. I don't know what it's called, <laughs> but I do think that it's definitely worth the escape if you are in um, Jakarta and you need to get out. Definitely do this. This is amazing. There's some team sports going on over here. So maybe nice for future activities or future team building. <laughs> I still want a flippin' beer. Holy shit. This is just way too much. But yeah. A bit a little bit of a sober Sally today. <laughs> but yeah, okay. We are here. Sun is setting. 
I think we're gonna leave after sunset, so it's just so beautiful. I'm so happy to be out of Jakarta. I'm definitely doing this again. For only 700,000, I think this is very, very good. <laughs> I just took a bunch of photos with the logo. <laughs> Adrian, Adrian. <laughs> oh no, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> Um, apparently there's beer on the main island, so I am super excited, but yeah, just look at that view, look at that, look at it, see it, eat it, do it, take it. <laughs> okay, so where are we going after this? We are going home to, to do what? Haraman, Haraman Island. To do what? Sleeping. Sleeping. Sleep. <laughs> I'm very tired. And what else? <laughs> no, I'm gonna go buy some beer. <laughs> la, la, la. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, we're gonna take the boat back. It's probably an hour to get back to the main island. And then food and beer. Just arrived back. <laughs> Tired. <laughs> there we go. Just arrived back and we're gonna. Yes. Oh, I already filled in two of those today. <laughs> quickly, quickly, quickly. So they need to do a questionnaire for school, right? Uh, Adrian. So just did my little <laughs> questionnaire. <laughs> oh, shit. There we go. Oh, okay, we're going home, we need to get changed, and then barbecue at 8 o'clock. So, we just got here, super tired, everyone's waiting, we're gonna get some barbecue now. Um, yeah, I could have done without the barbecue because they had food at the homestay as well, so now I feel bad that we're not eating, but they were expecting us, so I'm here, and I'm queer, and I'm ready <laughs> to go to bed. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is my humble abode, my new family, no foreigners, but it's fun, living them local life. La, la, la. So if you can see this, nope, it's not meat, it is sea snail. <laughs> It's not that bad. <laughs> um, I need some chili sauce, but I can't get it now. But, uh, 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 tastes like snails. Mm, like normal French snails. <laughs> With a chili sauce. Early morning here at the pier. Music's blasting. <laughs> and we are ready to take a boat again to some islands or some shit. See y'all later. We are now at the first island. It is called the Round Island in local English for you. <laughs> um, yeah, so there's a little bit of haze today. It should lift um, later on. So hopefully we'll be able to take nice pictures. Or it might just be pollution from Jakarta. The thing that I was trying to escape. <laughs> um, but it doesn't feel like pollution. I think it's more, more haze. But yeah, beautiful little island. It's called the Round Island because it's round. <laughs> 
so we are chilling here for like half an hour at this island um, just a quick few fun facts about the whole trip so um, it cost me 700,000 um, rupiah to come here with the accommodation and four meals were included so yesterday lunch dinner today breakfast and lunch um, so that was all included I upgraded my room to a private room just to you know have my little bit of privacy um, but yeah so 700,000 boat transfer everything included it's ridiculously cheap I'm, I did not take the um, the option where you can go with all the foreigners so I um, took the cheapest option which is with the locals and I myself and having lots of fun the people are so friendly and everywhere I come they just help me out and try to translate and, and all of that so that's really really nice and I also got to experience the local culture and what people here do um, I did a lot of questionnaires as a foreigner here to um, you know see what they can improve here so they asked me questions like that and what do I think of the facilities and all of that so I answered like three or four questions which was really really cool um, but yeah uh, some of these islands still have colonial buildings on it from the Dutch era and they colonized it so you can um, explore some of those islands there's Dutch uh, cemetery um, there's an island well on it like it's really really cool so these walls that you can see here in front of us, they were built around two, three hundred years ago um, by <laughs> the Dutch. Yeah, so there's lots of things and historical um, significance to these islands. Uh, there's another island which we won't be exploring that um, was used to quarantine people before they were allowed to go to Mecca, so they had to go to this, this island and, you know, I think they went through training because, I mean, why do you need to be quarantined? Um, but yeah, they were quarantined and then before that, the boat will take them directly from that island then to the Middle East so that they can go to Mecca. So yeah, that's just a little bit of fun fact um, for you about this area. Really, really nice. Like I mentioned earlier, it is a bit hazy today, but they say usually it looks by 10, 11 o'clock. But yeah, enjoy the video. One thing that I saw here that really upsets me is all the coral that they've taken from the ocean to build like a wall around this island. Now this happened years ago, so it's not happening anymore. But if you think of how much they must have taken from the ocean in order to build a structure like this then it's quite sad um, but yeah luckily this area is now protected so no one is allowed to do that anymore but yeah just a beautiful ocean view there again <laughs> so on this island is a turtle sanctuary um, we did go in I didn't really enjoy it because people were allowed to touch the turtles and pick them up and I didn't really agree with that so I didn't take any videos of the turtles being held by people so yeah if you're into things like that then I guess you can go but this was not for me so yeah just I don't know <laughs> it's not for me so yeah besides that it was a great experience yeah.